yes, we were able to put the ball down when we needed it. You know, to tell you the truth, Joe, I got to give uh, Messiah all the credit in the world. I mean, defensively, they were amazing and they were relentless and they played. You know, I you know I felt like Messiah really really played well, and thankfully we were able to match that intensity and make make big plays that had come by the end of the sets. And uh, Shannon did make big plays at the end of the sets, whether it was blocking, whether it was putting the ball down, and big momentum swings. And Julie is continuing to play well. She's very solid, uh, seldom makes mistakes, and is able to put the ball down. I just think it's such an advantage not to sit on a bus for two hours. And then have to get up, uh, warm up the background. We're used to the background. So we are able to pass. We just feel very comfortable at home. All the things that come with being a home team, um, I think thought came into play. I think the crowd helps when we have a moment, you know, when we're picking up momentum and we keep making good plays. Uh, but in the end, we have to do it ourselves. And I just think it's, it's, it's just an advantage to play at home. Uh, Widener was not playing well at the beginning of the season and convincing our team that Widener, who just beat Messiah, is why they're in third, because they are actually tied with Messiah. But Widener has the head-to-head -head advantage against Messiah. Uh, convincing them that Messiah, I mean, Widener is a really good team. You know, they took Eastern five, just like we did. That is going to be a dogfight. And um, Donovan's done a really good job with that team. And so... Uh, we're looking forward to that, but uh, have a lot of respect for Widener and what he's been able to do this year.